I hope everyone's having a good day. Yay. Well, we have raised a lot of money so far, but there is still time to raise even more, so get your credit cards out. Oh. Where's our dad? Oh, and he's actually come home. He's chucked up, apparently. I didn't take him anywhere, Mum. And I'd like to say a big thank you to Eric. £20,000, everybody! Hey, <laughs> and where's Faith? She's supposed to be handing over the keys. Oh, she's in bog, I think. So we are just waiting for the car to come back from being balloted, but while we wait, I would like to read a few words from Joe about the transport charity. Hang on, who's is that car? Debbie's, isn't it? Is that a wedding dress? It looks like it. Hey, what the hell is going on? Where's Joe? What do you mean, where's Joe? Is there something you forgot to tell me? Debbie, where is he? Where is my lovely grandson? No, no, I don't know where he Will is. Will somebody please tell me what is happening? She, they're getting married today. Well, how come you know and I don't? Because I was sworn to secrecy. Where is he? What's going on? I've no idea, babe. Where does he Oh, finally, my car has arrived. A welcome home party. How lovely. You really shouldn't have, Graham. Who are you? Me. <laughs> I own the place. I'm sorry, who is this woman? Kim Tate. Yeah. You don't mess with her. So she's Joe's mum? That's his step actually. I know, I don't look it. Nice dress, hun. Yeah, and she was supposed to be getting married today. But he's done a disappearing act. Hmm. So you're Debbie. Let's go inside, shall we? Where is Joe? Done a bunk, darling. Excuse me? What are you talking about? You obviously don't know the spoilt brat as well as I do. Inside now. I did, did, did. I'd just like to say that the auction is officially over. It's time to celebrate my homecoming, and you're all my guests. So please, do come inside. Cheers, everybody. What is going on? Can someone tell me what the hell is going on? We are supposed to be getting married right now. Marriage was never an option, and he knew that. What's this got to do with you? He loves me and we are getting married. Look, sweetheart, the only person Joe really loves is himself. Fact. So just accept it, all right? No, I won't accept it because none of this makes any sense. He wouldn't just up sticks anyway because he couldn't because everything he owns is here. He owns nothing. Not even the suit on his back. You did get it off him before he uh, left. I'm a tit too. Joe's my brother, but he never mentioned you. Oh, you must be Noah. Yeah. Well, I'm sorry to break this to you, kid, but you won't be seeing your brother again. I wouldn't get too upset. He never really cared for you much anyway. I mean, why would he? You're half dingle. And with Chris Tate as a father, well, let's just say the odds are severely stacked against you. Better you. Watch your mouth. You're a nasty piece of work, aren't you? And you are? Vanessa Woodfield, local vet. And my girlfriend, so watch your tongue. I don't take orders from an ex-prostitute. Enough. I mean it. Look, um, everything Joe told you was a lie. The house, the business, everything. So who are you then, Mr. Suave? For real? He was supposed to be keeping Joe in line. However, he didn't do a very good job of it. Seeing as the little runt tried to rip me off. Anything? Voice me again. Who's that? Tired con then. You'd probably have a lot in common. And the gentleman here? Local GP, so if someone decides to knife you in the back, we have a doctor on site. <laughs> so I hear Bernice has left the practice. Yeah. Hmm. Any idea why that is? I mean, I just saw you talking to her earlier. Uh, no. No, but then again, that's her business. Sure. So, uh, how are things going with you and Rishi? Hello, um, I'd just like to introduce myself. I'm Nicola. Nicola King. I'm James Hallridge. Ah. <laughs> yeah, and um, I'm Brenda. I'm the cafe owner. 
Oh, yes, I don't often frequent cafes, but in your case, I certainly won't be making an exception. Oh, OK. <laughs> ah, I'll eat you. You're funny. <laughs> and you are? Uh, Kerry, mm -hmm. it means I live in the village, you own my house. All right. I've just decided I'm repossessing it. Huh? <laughs> Joke. Oh, oh. For now. You can give me the keys to that car now, thank you. I don't think so. <laughs> Leave it, Faith. You don't know who you're dealing with. I don't care either. You'd be 20 grand for that car. Which is well short of what it's worth. So take a hike, Granny. And while you're at it, tell the rest of the clan to keep it down, will you? Especially that snivelling little wretch in the corner. She's spoiling the mood. Look, stop it, Charity! Yeah, don't be a I fool. am gonna have you! If I get there first, hon. Someone better watch the back then, eh? Well done. You've somehow managed to alienate most of the village. Good. May as well start as I mean to go on. Please try not to upset anyone else. <laughs>